Hey there. My teacher is running late and asked me to fill in today. You can call me, Professor Dan. I am going to go over multiplying by 1 tenth and 1 hundredth using the place value chart. When you move to the left on the place value chart, your numbers get 10 times bigger with each column. When you move to the right, your numbers get 10 times smaller with each column. This is helpful because moving from one column to the next means you are multiplying by 1 tenth. Let's try it out. I'll put the number 45.6 on the place value chart. If we multiply 45.6 by 1 tenth, it means our entire number needs to shift one place value to the right. Remember, multiplying by a fraction makes your number smaller. It's weird, I know. Just trust me. If we shift all of our digits one place value to the right, we get the number 4.56. If we want to multiply by 1 hundredth, we can shift our digits two place values. This is because 1 tenth times 1 tenth is 1 hundredth. If you move two place values to the right, you have multiplied by 1 hundredth. Let's reset our number and give it a try. We start with 45.6 and multiply by 1 hundredth. We are going to shift our digits two place values. We end up with the number 0.456. Nicely done. To review, moving to the left multiplies a number by 10 each column. Moving to the right multiplies a number by 1 tenth each column. If you move two columns, you have multiplied by 1 hundredth because 1 tenth times 1 tenth is 1 hundredth. When multiplying by 1 tenth, you can shift your digits one place value to the right around the decimal point. When multiplying by 1 hundredth, you can shift your digits two place values to the right around the decimal point. Have fun practicing this fun skill. I hear Mrs. Han coming and better get back to my seat.